Hello, everybody. I'm not used to not having my big centipede door open up. Hopefully this audio in the background is not horrible. Um, <laughs> it's copyright. Let's talk about this girl, Brooke Hoots. Oh, Lily's walking around. Hi, Lily. Um, yeah, that's how you, that's how you greet a dog, by the way. You give them pets, you say hello to them. I don't, I don't know if you've ever known that, uh, I don't know if you've known that, Brooks. Or Brooke, excuse me. Hoots, Holtz. Yeah, when your dog comes over to to like say hello, you don't push them. All right, guys, let's get into this video. <laughs> oh God, it's louder. The music got louder. Okay, so anyways, um, if you guys haven't seen, and there's no way, and holy hell, you haven't seen about this girl. Okay, she's plastered all over Twitter. Literally all over freaking Twitter. Everywhere. Some people are thinking she's a Twitch streamer. She's not. She's a YouTuber. And I think we should just go ahead, get right into the video. I'll bring it up on screen here in a minute. Let me, um, let me pause this, this copyright free music. I'm not about that. All right, you guys ready? Let's open her up. There she is. Let's watch this together, okay? Oh, I need to... I put plastic wrap on the door. I'm gonna have him run out. We're just gonna see what he does. I don't know. Let's stop right there. Hopefully that audio output was a lot. Did, did we see what she did here? Did we see what she did here? I'm gonna prank my dog. Ha 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 ha. Hilarious, right? Let's let's just... prank our dogs. Okay. See what he does. I don't know. Look, right there. Dog jumps up, smacks him. Chase is after him. I don't know about you guys, but when a dog jumps up on me, I usually am like, oh my god, how cute. Have, have you ever been in a situation where a dog jumps up on you? I'm sure all of us have. You don't immediately go, bah. What the fuck, Brooke? What the fuck, Brooke? All right, so continuing on, let's... Look at this. Right there. Did you hear that? We're going to get into that later. Did you hear her spit on her dog? How many times have any of you pinned your dogs down because they're walking around and then spit on them? Absolutely horrible, horrible behavior coming from somebody whose channel, I'm sorry, I'm shaking the desk, whose channel is literally all about my dog, my dog, my dog. Her last like four videos I think was about her dog. All right. We love you. Do you? Do you love us, Brooke? We love you. Probably don't love me, that's for sure. We love you. Look at that. Dog says, hi, I gotta give you a kiss. Don't touch me. Don't fucking touch me. That's exactly what this means right here. When you point at a dog, do either they're doing something bad or it's just like, hey. I, I don't understand that, okay? Hold on, let's, let's pop her down for a second so you can see my pajamas. I don't... I don't know about you guys, but usually when I get a kiss, I'm over the moon in excitement. I'm like, oh my god, I'm getting kisses. Not, get the fuck off me. I'm sorry, I'm cussing too much in this video. YouTube's not gonna like it. How? Let's just keep going until I can get to the end here. Do you hear that? You hear Lily? Do you hear her arguing? Because she's like, just as upset as I am. Hi, baby. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, like, there she goes again. Lily is just as heated about this as I am. Do you hear her? She's fine. She's, when I just start getting loud, she starts getting loud. <laughs> Why? Why is this an okay thing to do? If Lily would have just went and gave me kisses, I'd be like, ah, not freak out. Whoa, look at this dog's mouth here. It looks like he's like, I don't know. Look, he's so happy. Do you hear her? At first I thought that was the dog crying, but I think that's her yelling laid down. And I want to point out to you guys, if you tell a dog to lay down, they should, they should lay down. But you have to kind of train them first to do that. You can't just scream at them to lay down. And, and the reason I'm bringing- this will come up again later. 
Yeah, she's definitely saying lay down. You see her? Did she- Oh! Okay. My air conditioner kicked on and I hope you guys can't hear it. Well, anyways, let's go ahead and get into her apology here, okay? When I was saying we're gonna talk about this stuff later all throughout the video, this is what we're gonna talk about, okay? So let's go ahead and open up this apology to everyone who has been commenting on my social media as of recently. Anything I say isn't going to make those who believe I'm a bad person stop believing that. And I am aware of this. I apologize to anyone who's been affected negatively by this footage. <laughs> Lily in the back. First off, I want to address the uncut footage on the on the day in particular that video was filmed and actually this past week things in my outside life have been less than exceptional i am not going to play the victim card or anything of that sort isn't your dog the victim not you let's see here i lost my spot <laughs> okay or anything of the sort but i do want to point out that i am rarely as upset as what was shown on the footage. The bubbly, happy-go-lucky Brooke that you often see in my videos is typically an accurate representation of me, but it is obvious that I am playing up my mood in this video when I'm clearly, actually, frustrated. I get you're frustrated, but it's a dog, you know? Lily is whining at me. For some reason, I think it's because I'm on the computer again. If I'm just gonna be honest, I'm always on this damn thing. Um, but it's not like I'm not going out there and like freaking out on her. I'm just gonna like give her pets, calm her down. I'm gonna go do that now. Hold on. <laughs> She's like really wanting some love. Hold on. So I gave her pets and she walked away from me. <laughs> so I guess she didn't want pets. Like petted, excuse me. Pet-eyed? Pet-eyed? Oh, that sounds like scent for feet. Um, anyways, but like, it's getting close to her breakfast time. You have to excuse her. She's, she's getting restless. All right, so back to this apology. So let's pull this back up here. That being said, this does not justify me yelling at my dog in the way I did. I am fully aware that, what, fully aware of that, excuse me. Should I have gotten as angry as I did? No. Should I have raised my voice and yelled at him? No. Well, if you knew it was wrong, why did you do it, for one? However, my 75-year-old Doberman is jumping up in my face with his mouth open. I do, as a dog parent, have to show him this behavior is unacceptable. But I want to make it known regardless of what my dog does. I should not have acted the way towards him. My thing... Hold on, let me put my face back on this screen. My thing is, what do you mean have to show him this behavior is unacceptable? By smacking him in the mouth? That's how we do that? So, I guess if you ever have kids... <laughs> Lily, <laughs> what are you doing? Why are you on about... Hold on, it's not time for your breakfast. I know that's what you want. It's not time. You still got, like... They eat their breakfast at the same time every morning. And about this time, she starts getting too restless for it. Um, Lily, come on, baby. You want to come up in the video, Mama? Yeah? Yeah, you want to come up in the video, Mama? Well, maybe this is what she wanted all along. Hi. Oh, kiss? You snuck a kiss? Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Um, anyways, let's keep reading on with this, uh, this apology here. I do as a dog parent have to show it unacceptable. That that's that pisses me off. That really, really does. You know, there's so many different kind of training ways to teach your dogs not to jump up. You know, there's the old like knee trick where you just stick your knee up in the air and then they won't be able to like really grab on you and they learn to stop jumping. Stuff like that. Well let's keep reading here. I want to clarify that I'm not a dog abuser or an animal abuser in any way, shape, or form. Anyone who has witnessed or heard true animal abuse will be able to I want to clarify that I'm not a dog abuser or animal abuser. Is this the same freaking sentence? Um, in any shape or form. What is this? This is the exact same sentence, sorry. I'll put the link to the PDF that I got this from in the description. My dog is no way, shape, or form was hurt by any action that was displayed in this video. I know people are going to say, you don't know how he really feels. And this is true. But if he was audib audibly and physically in pain... 
it would be a different story. I also did not spit on my dog. That is a blatant lie. Do we need to like show that clip again of her spitting on her dog? Yeah, let's 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 show that again. But yeah, she definitely spit on her dog and that's ridiculous. Let's go ahead and pull this apology back up again. Let's see. Did I get in his face to take necessary actions tube? Yes, I did. And that was not the way I should have handled the situation. Did I spit on my dog? No. Prove that wrong. My family and I are in the process of getting him trained. The training that I have been looking for at the time is very expensive because I, it have to be a one-on-one -on -one with a trainer. Ever since he was attacked at the dog park, he isn't okay with being around other dogs. He sticks to me like Velcro. If he is in the presence of another dog, even a little chihuahua, I can't, I just can't see him getting what he needs from a group training environment. That being said, I know per, I know I personally can learn more effective techniques to get his energy out and keep him well disciplined. I don't know what to say about this one. Do you know what to say about this one? Huh? Oh, kisses. That's what you gotta say? Oh, kisses? Okay. <laughs> Alright, so at this point, Lily has decided to take a nap in my lap. <laughs> and it is the cutest thing. Who would think a 65-pound dog would want to be a lap dog? <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and, like, power through the rest of this apology. Now, there was a discussion earlier in this about, uh, training. About how, like, the training is expensive or something i just can't get a group training environment that being said here's my thing you do not have to go to group training i know for a fact pet smart offers one-on-one -on -one training and if financial reasons seem to be why you can't do it i think they offer single classes for like 40 dollars, and for one dog for a six-week training course it's like 120 dollars We'll just power through the rest of this. I would never do anything purposely or physically to mentally harm any animal. Again, I should not have yelled at him or been physically aggressive as I was. And I'm fully aware of that. Here's my thing. You know, you know if she's doing it while she's recording a video, the only reason she's sorry is she got caught. Honestly, that, that's gotta be like, literally the only thing I could think of because if you're so quick to automatically smack your dog in the mouth and the only time are you giving me kisses on my elbow the only time that you have a problem with you know addressing it is when people call you out on your shit that's that's what I'm not about here let's see family and friends have spent any amount of time with sphinx and me know that we have a trusting loving relationships all he wants to do is be by my side cuddle me and be around me which i love that's something i understand because that's how lily is you guys can see that's how lily is right this second but but you're beating your dog though okay and then it goes about my twitter i deactivated my account earlier in the day when i went to open it i was met with excess notifications of people telling me that i messed up a bad person I'm a messed up bad person I'm shaking my desk <laughs> that I'm going to hell that I belong in jail etc that's animal abuse for my own mental health and no other reasons besides that I don't think it was necessary for me to be reading these comments at the time lastly I don't want to make a state this statement seem like it was me defending myself because that is not my goal I do want to point out that it, what actually happened though my intent by explaining the situation is to give those of you who are rightfully angry at me the explanation you deserve. I am getting my dog into training. Good. And I'm looking at ways to improve how I personally train him at home. I am sorry that you guys had to watch the footage and were upset by it. Like, don't apologize to the viewers. Like, really. Don't apologize to the viewers. Go apologize to your dog. And I'm sorry to my dog- oh, well, there it is- <laughs> for raising my voice and acting aggressively. In my heart and from the words of the people that spend the most time with me, I know that I'm a great dog mom, but not perfect. That's like saying, oh, I'm a great husband. I only beat my wife once a day. That I spoil them the best ways. Blah, blah. In my heart and from the words of the people that spend the most time with me. Why is it up with this PDF? Sorry. 
on a serious note, I love you guys, and I want to thank you for pointing out things that you think are wrong and discussing them. Because the world needs more of that. I hope you give me a chance to prove that these statements about myself do align with my actions. All my love, Brick, what, Brooke, whatever your last name is. Oh, puppy on. <laughs> I was just uh, taking a minute here to pet Lily and think about this. I just, it makes me sad, you know? Like, right now, I'm shaking my camera because, like, Lily's putting all her weight on my leg and it's, like, making my leg shake. But I love her and look how happy she is. She's falling asleep. But I've got a few more things to show you here real quick, guys. I'm sorry, we will. I'm sorry. Sorry I took my arm, baby. So here is a graph of what's been going on. I don't know what happened to this girl in April 19 to where her monthly views divided by negative 5 million. Negative 5 million. That is a lot. I don't know what happened in April and maybe that's why she did this. Accidentally uploading this. Because if you actually look at her, if I say actually one more time, I'm going to freak out. If you open up her social blade here, and let me make that a little bit bigger for you guys. Look at this. Ever since this controversy has happened, she went from making anywhere to 11 to $177 a day, up to making 92 to 1.5K since this pretty much has happened. I don't want to point out money or publicity or any of this, but something about that that doesn't feel right. You know, you've had a huge divot around April to where I'm assuming you, you lost a lot of uh, views and supplemental income. But I, I don't know how I feel about that, honestly. I saw that social blade and I was like, that's that doesn't make sense. So, you know, other YouTubers might have more tea than I have. And my feelings on this is it's disgusting. It, it really is. You know, you don't go to a shelter or a breeder and look at a dog in the eyes. I'm just gonna fucking annihilate you, you know? You look at them like love and like they're your babies and all that stuff. Especially if most of your content here is about your dog. Like we got, uh, you know, stuff they do together... A day in the life of the dog. Just, maybe it's not 90%. I do see a lot of, like, uh, I don't know. I don't know what she's doing in this, honestly. But, <laughs> within, like, the past two months, it's the seven videos you have is all about your dog. And then, all of a sudden, you're beating your dog. Like, where, where is the dog in all these other videos? Are they in these other videos? I'm not caught up with my, with my YouTuber lore. Oh, my belly's gone. It's time for food. But I, I ain't caught up with her to know how long she's had this dog. So if somebody if somebody has any idea, please, please let me know. But it's a shitty situation. And God, it just makes me sad. It really does. Come here, Lou. Is that more comfortable? Sorry, she was, like, leaning off, and I'm trying to give her, like, an extra little bit of arm so she could lay her head on. Yeah, she's comfortable. Look at her. Like, dogs are a gift to this world, and if you're gonna treat your dog like that, yeah, it could end up with hundreds of people worse, but it can end up with thousands that are gonna be better parents for it. Alright, guys, well, I hope you enjoyed this video. I have been recording, I feel like, forever now. Be sure to like, subscribe, and do all that jazz if you want to. It's up to you. Or follow me on Twitch. That's, that'd be pretty fucking cool, too. But I'll check you guys in the next video. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Back to sleep. All right. Everybody, y'all have a good night. Peace out, homebrays.